Today was a good day. What's up, you guys? Chase the Dark Sage here, back with another Funko Pop review. This is definitely not a review. What's up, you guys? Chase the Dark Sage here, back with another Funko Pop video. But before we get into it, go ahead and hit that like button right now, because I know y'all forget. I know y'all forget, because you know, I be seeing the, the, the views and the likes be looking different, so I know y'all forget. So go ahead and hit that like button right now so you won't. Secondly, if you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. I do Funko Pop content on a weekly basis, so I do come out with a video for Pops at least once a week. Uh, more, but if you want to be notified of that, you can hit the notification bell at the bottom of where you can subscribe to me as well. If you're a returning viewer to the channel, welcome to the channel. Thirdly, follow your boy on Instagram. If you follow me on Instagram, uh, you get to see like a lot of the Pops that I get like obviously behind the scenes or like off the camera basically. And I kind of, well, Technically, I'm still putting them on camera because I put them on Instagram. But y'all get the point. I put a lot of the pops that I get on a daily basis on my Instagram because I don't need to make a single video for each pop I get. So follow me on Instagram. The link will be in the description below. So let's go ahead and get into the video. So today is payday and I thought to myself, let me go ahead and look for some deals on some pops that I'm really searching because 2020, this is the year that the completionist really comes out of me and I go full throttle with it. I mean, really full throttle. I'm sorry for that. If you notice on my Instagram, I have been starting and collecting Attack on Titan. You can see from the new backdrop I have behind me, you can actually see Cleaning Levi right here, which is pretty funny. And Aaron Titan, that's my boy. That's my boy, Aaron. But I have been collecting Attack on Titan and I've actually just finished the show and I really, really like it, guys. It was a great recommendation from friends and uh, other pop collectors on my channel. So go ahead and follow me on Instagram, like I said, so we could talk one-on-one. -on -one. Y'all could tell me about uh, animes to watch and other pops to get started there so I could do reviews on them and have a broader horizon of knowledge, extensive knowledge of pop culture. But let's go ahead and go into it. This is a local Facebook pickup. I got all these pops, $135. I bought from this guy previously some Attack on Titan pops, and he has more pops that I like, a lot of anime pops. That, uh, he has a lot of anime pops that I really need in my collection and the complete collection, especially the commons. And let's be real, a lot of people have a hard time moving commons, but I'm the guy that likes to buy the commons from people. So let's go ahead and go into it. $135 local Facebook pickup. Let's see what it looks like. So this is the bag he gave me. Like I said, I bought from him before, so I guess I'm a trusted seller because he does cut me a lot of deals on a lot of bolted pops that I necessarily wasn't collecting at the time or I don't collect now, but these are some of the anime pops I got. So let's see what's in the bag. First up, we got Armin Arlet. This is like the best friend of uh, Mikasa and uh, what's his name? Aaron, best friend of Aaron and this childhood friend. And I had to have an Armin Arlet pop, especially what happens in season three, part two. Wow, just what happens in that season. This is a great addition to my pop collection and uh, he will definitely be going on this wall um, somewhere. I don't know, you clearly see that there's no room and this room is meant for Roy, which I should be getting soon. Arm and Arlet, dope, FYE exclusive. Y'all, I'm gonna take these out the box at one point, you know, put them on the camera, but you know, not right now, not right now. Something happening in the future, so not right now. Next up, we got the goat himself. Levi this I got the cleaning Levi right here like I said earlier and uh now I got the regular Levi I believe this is vaulted because he's like 20 bucks now I never see him in stores I remember when I first was collecting uh, I used to see all the Attack on Titan pops in stores but now I don't obviously because it's such a big thing now and pops are such a big thing so a lot of people are just buying them up and I guess he's not part of the well yeah he's not part of the first wave I guess this is like the second or third wave I really don't know too much about the Attack on Titan pops like that I just know that I need to get them all because I'm a completionist and uh, it looks pretty dope. He put them in a pop protector, but these pop protectors trash. And then last for the Attack on Titan pops that I copped. Aaron Titan form. Y'all see that I got the Hot Topic exclusive like right there. Aaron Titan form, the one thing I'm disappointed about with these pops, especially like just really just the Aaron Titan form. Why is he not a six inch? He's literally the same size as like the Armor Titan or the Female Titan. Why is this pop not a six inch? Granted, we do have two of them, but why is he not a six inch? Come on, Funko, tell me why, please. All right, guys, so the next series I'm about to pull out is actually just one series. I just need to complete it all. I am missing two out of the bunch, so I should be getting those soon because y'all know how I am with completing my sets. All right, guys, first two pops from the new set that I am collecting. Avatar, this is Aang on, with Air Scooter, and then this is Aang and Momo. This is the common version. This is just Aang, the Hot Topic exclusive. I wasn't collecting Avatar when they first came out, but obviously I missed out. And I got the Chase version. I believe I did an unboxing of it on my Instagram. So 
Go follow me on Instagram at Dark Sage Collections. I'm just glad to have this because this is literally one of my favorite cartoons. Some people consider this an anime. I'm not really sure what to consider it. I consider it a cartoon, but some people do consider it an anime. If so, uh, my anime knowledge is very extensive then. Then we got Katara and Sokka. That box light is just hitting a different type of way. Sokka and Katara, brother and sister from the Water Tribe, Waterbender. Um, probably me if I was an anime character, basically. I'm, I'm not going to lie. Uh, Sokka is one of my favorite characters from Avatar. Katara is a pretty dope character as well. I really like the detail on these pops, especially with her water bending, like right here. It's a pretty dope pop. Like, I gotta blame my boy Kevin because if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be collecting these pops. And you know what? I don't really need to be spending extra money that I really do have, but I don't have. But I really do have it. I don't need to be spending extra money, so I blame him. Go check out his podcast at High Functioning Dimwits on Apple Podcasts, Spotify. I I'll put his link to his podcast and all that below. It's pretty good. Listen. Then the last two, sadly, I don't have the other two that I need to complete the set, and it hurts my soul. Toph and Appa. Appa is uh, Aang's flying bison. This was granted to him, I think, through the monks of the airbending style, I guess. And Toph, she's an air, she's an earthbender. I forgot necessarily. I think she's like of a royal family. I haven't seen the show in years since I was like in like freshman year of high school or like middle school guys so you're gonna have to you're gonna have to uh excuse me not knowing everything but i really like the detail like i said on these pots especially the, like the the people who have like bending abilities because you can see like what she bends like this rock right here so that really stabilizes how she stands and i'm gonna have to do a review on the pop oh i'm gonna have to do a pop review on these because these are just so dope like these will probably look great out the box but y'all know i don't keep stuff out the box i got stuff in the box in a pop protector vaulted vinyl to be exact so guys that's it for my haul video i just wanted to post a video just let y'all know what i'm collecting the things i'm doing in 2020 because all is because i because let's be because let's be real i put on for the completion of the song here you know what i'm saying ain't nobody ain't nobody gonna tell me that i don't have 100 percent. ain't nobody nobody gonna tell me that i don't have 100 percent. why do i keep messing up that word ain't nobody gonna tell me that i don't have 100 percent collection I just saw a whole bunch of spit fly out. And I know some people might say, say it, don't spray it, but I don't care. But that's it for the video, guys. Don't forget to hit that like button for your boy, because like I said, I really appreciate it. Also, comment uh, some of your favorite pops from this haul that I got, because this haul is pretty extensive. I got it all for $135. I know it doesn't seem like much, but to me, it's much, because y'all know I got to complete some sets. Also, don't forget to follow me at Dark Sage Collections on Instagram. I do follow back. I do talk to people if you, uh, you know, send me a message or send me some pops. Because I know a lot of people on there uh, help me out by just sending me, oh, this pop is coming out. And I'm really grateful for all y'all, to be real. Thank you guys for watching. Dark Sage out. Peace.